you broke through security, and now it's time to see what these intruders are doing in here. Buckle up, because you're going for a ride. Before we begin, be sure to grab lore collectible number two of five on your way to this fight. Team composition for Atrax 1, again, won't matter too much in the grand scheme of the fight. While things like wards and wells are encouraged, I do not think they are completely necessary other than for safety reasons or if you want to guarantee some more damage on the boss. Weapon-wise, I would prioritize a slightly longer range primary weapon like a pulse if you're more passive, but nearly any primary weapon will be fine. I cannot suggest anything other than the lament for boss damage at this moment in time. The Lament, in its current form, one cycles this boss with ease, and using anything else is currently a waste of time. Should the Lament ever be nerfed, then any sword will be the next best option. Best of all, if you're able to do the raid, you have access to getting the Lament because you own Beyond Light. Just get the Lament. My guide is on the channel now. The goal of this encounter is to damage Atrax 1 during very short damage windows by identifying which of the duplicates are real via the use of the scanner buff, while simultaneously getting rid of said duplicates by dropping them in an airlock and having them get sucked into space. You're going to split your team into two groups, the base team and the space team. The space team will take the elevators next to where the boss spawns up into space when the fight begins. Assign someone on both teams to be a scanner as you'll be trading this buff back and forth during the fight. You should also assign someone to be the operator. When you start the fight, Atrax and multiple copies of Atrax will spawn in, four on each level. They will all just patrol around in a small area where they spawn in, shooting at everyone non-stop. They will all be immune. At first, both teams will just be killing enemies as they spawn in, while waiting for servitors, operator, and scanner enemies to spawn in. The scanner will spawn in space, and the operator will spawn in the base. Let's talk about the roles of the operator and scanner for this fight. The scanner's job is simple. They must identify which of the copies of Atrax 1 is the real and thus damageable one. You'll be able to tell which is the real one because it'll be glowing yellow while the others will not. The scanner buff, again, will spawn in space, but in a random location, left, bottom, or right. The operator will be in charge of removing duplicate copies of Atrax from players, a mechanic we'll talk about in a minute. Operators are also capable of sending elevators up and down, as well as opening the airlocks. The operator buff will spawn in the base, also in a random location. The operator will want to be in space eventually though, but there are a couple of ways to handle this. Shortly after the fight starts, six servitors will spawn, one on the left, middle, and right sides of both sections of the arena, along with the scanner and operator enemies. The servitors tend to spawn in two waves though, they won't all show up instantly. Killing all of the servitors will trigger the damage phase, so make sure everyone is ready with their buffs before you do that. I mentioned that the operator needs to be in space, let's talk about why and what the operator will do in this encounter. After all six servitors are killed, the extinction protocol will trigger, starting in space, then going to the base, then back to space, then back to base. This is where the scanner needs to identify which of the four duplicates is real and then stop Atrax by attacking. All team members should dump as much damage into Atrax as possible at the same time as the copy will despawn in only a couple of seconds after starting your attack. Taking too long to attack or attacking the wrong one is not ideal, as you might imagine. When the duplicate despawns, it'll drop a ball on the ground. This must be picked up. If it's not picked up within a few seconds, a copy of Atrax will pop out of it and will instantly kill everyone. When picked up, it will turn into a debuff, killing the player holding it after 40 seconds. However, the operator can shoot this ball off of a player's head, dropping it on the ground again. It can be picked up again by the same or a different player, refreshing the timer. The only person that should avoid grabbing one is the operator because you can't shoot it off your own head, and switching buffs in the middle of a damage phase can be a little bit risky. 
Keep in mind that if you're an operator and you're using a sword on Atrex, that you may accidentally pick up this ball. It's not a death sentence, but it is a bit of an inconvenience. Around the space arena are several airlocks with a button that the operator can shoot to open the door. In between space and base duplicate scanning moments, the operator and the player with the duplicate should head to an airlock. The player with the duplicate should go into the airlock when it's shot open while the operator shoots the duplicate off of their head. Once it's off, the player can leave. Just make sure the dupe doesn't bounce back out of the airlock and that you accidentally don't pick it back up again. Note that there are multiple ways to handle these debuffs. You can do them one or two at a time. You can stockpile all of them to do at the same time. You should just go with whatever works for your team. This begs the question, how should you get the operator buff into space? There are two methods and both work. The first method is to send the operator up via elevator launch pod immediately, meaning four players will be in space and two in the base. This is much simpler to do, but it does leave an imbalance of players, which certain teams may struggle with. The second method is to send the operator buff up via the augment terminal station. While you'll be able to maintain three in space and three in the base, you can only use the terminals when there are no servitors alive. When no servitors are alive, the damage phase begins. And after the first damage phase in space, the base will get a damage phase and they need to make sure that they have the scanner from someone in space. So you can transfer operator, but you just need to make sure that communication is very clear as to when it is being sent. Send down the scanner first and have a base player grab it, then send up the operator buff into space. In case this wasn't implied already, when you drop a buff in a terminal, it can be grabbed from any other terminal. So that sounded like a lot, and it is if you're trying to know literally everything that's happening at once, but it's not that bad in practice. Let's review the whole phase as it happens at the same time now, instead of just one part of it. There will be four damage phases alternating between space and base, two each, always starting in space. The scanner identifies the copy. You deal a bunch of damage. The copy dies, and someone picks up the ball. The scanner drops their scanner buff in the terminal, and the base team picks it up. The operator and the duplicate holder go to an available airlock to launch the duplicate into space. The base team does their damage phase and grabs a duplicate. Base team scanner sends scanner back up to the space team. Duplicate player from base team takes a launch pod to space. The second space damage phase happens in the exact same way, and by the time this is over, the operator should refresh the duplicate on the base player who just came up into space and take both the space and base players to a different airlock to launch their duplicates into space while the scanner sends their buff back down for the final base damage phase. The final two players in the base do their damage phase, grabbing the duplicate and going up, leaving one player remaining in the base. Send the scanner buff back up top. The duplicate player from the base team will meet with the operator to eject that fourth duplicate of the phase. If it's time for final stand, any remaining base players should go to space. If it's not, then players should go back to their original positions. If you're all using the Lament, then this should be a pretty easy one cycle, as long as everyone is doing the damage combo correctly. That damage combo is guard, then three light attacks, then go into the heavy attack. Once you deal enough damage for final stand, everyone should be in space. Atrax will duplicate many more times and begin the extinction protocol again. The scanner must identify the correct one, and then the entire raid group should go to that duplicate and deal as much damage as possible. Make sure to pick up the ball that drops from this duplicate, otherwise you will wipe. A second duplicate will become the target, and the scanner should identify and lead the team again to this duplicate as well, and so on until the boss dies. The third duplicate will eventually trigger a wipe, so if you don't kill Atrax by the third one, it's a wipe. I know that this was a lot to take in, so I'm going to provide examples of both the scanner and the operator roles in action. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you at the next guide.
Oh, I hate falling bullets through a wall. Middle servitor is one shot. Okay. What about Scanner's the right servitor? Dead. Where is it at? Left? Oh, I see him. I see him. I see him. Okay. Right, uh, right servitor is weak as well. I'm going to go up. You Don't thinking? kill it just yet. I'm waiting on your call. Okay. I'm getting attacked. I'm, I'm riding up. I mean, it is dead, right? Which one? Middle. Right side's alive still. Oh, okay. All right, top server, top right server's dead. Oh, here we go, here we go. To the right. Uh, bottom middle, bottom middle, bottom middle. Ready and go. Yeah. Mark, grab it. Let's go over here. Semi, it's down. Got it. Uh, wait, I can't open that door. Yeah, just cycle to a different door. Left side has up and bottom as well. Yeah, le left side lower. That's my third exotic. Far left, far left. Okay, you're good, Mark. Give me a sec. Go. God, I just feel like I'm doing nothing. Just kill I'm ads in the meantime. Yeah. Pass buff. I have buff. I'm going up. Got it. Charging my heavy sword attack. Drone. Hey, but bottom middle, bottom middle. Okay. Back middle. The only one left. Coming. Ready. Coming. Go. Dead on behind you afterwards. Okay. Reset. Coming semi. Coming semi. Uh, let's go. Um, bottom right. Bottom right. Got it. There's other terminals in this building, right? Not just one, or no? Lower left, come back to us. You're both clear. I have a punch. Um, I don't have it, do you have it? Grab it, no. grab it, Sun four. I got it. All right, I'm sending buff up. Yeah, did we four set. cycle when he did it? Dado, you need to send more. Um, yeah, I, I just sent two down. I accidentally sent one up. Like, cause the music still back. is going. Yeah, yeah, we, got, we got Rowan to do. Yeah, you oh. Thank you. Uh, let's go. Um, um, right here. You're clear. You wave just started. Yeah, I'm ready to finish it. Lower side uh, ready. Where where was the? Hang on, I'm not I'm not ready. Top yet. right, top right, top right. Okay. Okay. Left top. Left space servitor is ready. Right spray is ready? Yeah, I'm We're good. I mean I'm hurt, but I can we can try. Just get on there. Just call it. Mine's dead. Go. Dead? Left dead. 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 Got it, mine's dead. Right dead. Uh right, uh, right. on me, on me, on data. Back middle, back middle. Okay, I put give me operator a in, I put operator in. I have a bubble, give me a second. You're good. Alright, three, two, one, go. Operators in the thing, someone's gotta grab it. Okay. Right here. Sith, Sith right, right. here. You can grab it. I always forget this thing's here. Where you going to go? Yep. Come over here, Trim. Scanner's passed. Got it. Down. Who has here. it? Okay. It's he healed. He healed, I think. Send scanner what? when you can. Send scan. Thank you. I just pulled. I just oh, yeah, pulled yeah. it. You have it, too. Yeah. I think he healed. I wasn't 100% yeah, watching, I think, but I think, I think he healed. so as well. Where's it at? Uh, right side. Right side. All right. Hold on, Mike. Three. Two, one, go. Refresh me, Sith. Thank you. I think Dad, right you have here. it. No, no Trevin, it's right on the floor. Okay, yeah. okay, I got it, I got it. So oh, that yeah, door right next to you guys. That door right next to you guys. Grab a scanner from him, Flim. Yeah. Go, uh, run, go, run. Yeah, just grab it. Grab it from yeah. the. Run, run. Yeah. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. 